In this video, I'm going to explain the calculation of a final draft when a weight is shifted. So let us consider this example where this is the vessel and this is the water line. For sake of simplicity, let us assume that the vessel is at even keel. That means the forward draft and aft draft is same or the trim is zero, whether uh, all the draft throughout is same trim is zero and we consider this scenario now let us also consider that center of flotation is a midship the center of flotation is the point about which the ship trims well this is the geometrical center of a water plane area let me mark this water plane area well uh, if the ship is floating like this this is the water plane area this is the going to be water plane area and the geometrical center of this water plane area is a center of flotation since the center of flotation is a midship the change in the forward draft is tf so initially the draft was this however after shifting this weight my draft is this one only so TF is the change in the forward draft. Similarly, TA is the change in aft draft. So initially the aft draft was this, but now the draft is increased to this one. So TA is the change in aft draft. Since the center of flotation is a midship, the change in the draft forward, that is TF, and the change in the draft aft TA will be equally divided so we can say that ta will be equal to tf now let us consider the scenario where the center of flotation is not a midship so that means the center of flotation is not a midship and this is very much possible because of the shape of the ship the geometrical center or the geometrical water plane area could be different so the geometrical center may not be exactly at a midship so this center of flotation could be a little bit uh, displaced from a midship. Well, in this case, let us consider this triangle, this green triangle. And this is nothing but a TC. TC is the trim cost. So I can put it this way also. Initial trim was a zero. Initial trim was zero. Ship was at even keel. But the final trim after shifting the weight final trim after shifting the weight say final trim was t so what is the total uh, trim caused so trim caused is zero minus t that is t only i can write like this tc trim cost is tc so here this is the trim cost so 10 theta is tc divided by lbp where this is the angle now similarly let us consider another triangle say this was the f center of flotation and let us consider this a small triangle and this distance is lcf this distance is lcf well this lcf means longitudinal center of flotation from aft perpendicular and this is the ta change in the draft aft because of this TA is the change in the draft aft because of shifting. And again in this blue triangle, we have this theta. And this triangle theta, 10 theta is TA divided by LCF. Well, this distance is LCF. Let me mark it again. This is LCF. So, so we have this relationship where TA divided by LCF is equal to TC divided by LBP or simply TA is LCF divided by LBP into TC and this is a pretty useful uh, relationship here. We will also notice that total trim cause that is TC will be equal to TA plus a TF that is the sum of the change in the trim aft and trim forward will be the total trim. We can verify this here from here also this portion is tf and this is ta and this total portion is tc 
okay well now let us proceed further say for example this is a vessel a and this is the length say vessel is of 100 meter and this is the midship and now the center of flotation is 2 meter forward let me just mark here with this color so hf is 2 meter forward so we can say af or lcf is 50 this is 50 this is going to be 50 meter and this plus 2 meter so total distance of center of flotation from aft is going to be 52 meter now we also know that the ship pivots about this point that is the center of a flotation vessel will pivot about this point okay now let's have some draft say forward draft is let me just mark forward draft is 6 meter and aft draft is 8 meter so we know the trim is the difference between forward draft and aft draft so let me find this the trim is a 2 meter by a stern and let's have this weight here w okay now i shift this uh, w weight from aft to forward after shifting this weight from aft to forward We'll, uh, there will be a trim, um, trimming movement and this trimming movement is W into D. So here let us assume this weight was W which is 200 ton and it is shifted to a distance of a 60 meter. So we'll have the trimming movement 200 into 60 is equal to 12,000 ton meter by head. Why by head? Because I shifted this weight from aft to forward so there will be a trimming moment in forward direction and now we know that the trim cost can be calculated by trimming moment divided by mctc where as per the definition mctc is the moment to change the trim by one centimeter so in this scenario let's say the trimming moment is one two zero 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 and let's say the mctc is 200 so we have this 60 centimeter trim cost and that will be by head by head now let us work out what is a trim aft change in the draft aft will be af divided by l into tc well we had uh, found this formula that a ta is uh, LCF divided by LBP into trim cost. In the short form, instead of LCF, I am writing this AF and instead of LBP, I am just writing AL and into TC. So, well, AF is 52 and L is 100 and the TC is 60. So, this will give me... Let me use the calculator to find out. 52 multiplied by 60 divided by 100 so this gives me 31.2 so this gives me 31.2 centimeter and we also know that the formula of total trim cost is tc is equal to ta plus uh, tf so this relationship will give me tf that is trim forward is equal to tc minus ta so let's find out the tc is uh, 60 minus 31.2 i think i should use the calcium 60 minus 31.2 plus 60 is equal to 28.8 so here the forward draft was 6 meter and aft draft was 8 meter and because of the shifting from aft to forward we have some change in the trim total trim cost is 60 centimeter which this 60 centimeter has been divided in uh, two parts which is ta and tf so let me summarize how we write say initial draft initial uh, draft is say let me put it here for forward and aft and it is better to write in three places so six meter like this meter and aft is eight meter now 
change in the draft aft and change in the draft forward so first let's write the forward one which is 28.8 centimeter so in meter is going to be 0 0.288 similarly this aft one is going to be 31.2 so we can write 0 0.3 one two meter and we know that the vessel was uh, the weight was uh, shifted forward weight was shifted forward so we have the streaming movement by head S hence the forward draft will increase let me just add here the forward draft will increase and aft draft will uh, reduce so the final draft is going to be final draft will be 6.288 meter and this one will be 8 minus 0 0.312 then let me use the calcium again so here 8 minus 0 0.312 will give me 7.688 7 0.688 meter and this is a good idea to have this draft in three places.